Hey guys, what's up? Today in the Brick Lab, we're going to be giving plastic surgery to Rocky 2.0. So I call this guy Rocky 2.0, but really, he's more like Rocky 0.0. And in fact, if I hadn't gotten a request to fix this guy up, I probably would have left him on the shelf, even though he was on sale when I bought him. And this guy has issues that are too numerous to name, but you know what? We're just going to go ahead and do it anyway. Uh, first up, we have issues with the head here, which can't move up or down or side to side. The mouth can open and close menacingly, but really, how menacing can you be when your head is stuck in one position? The answer, not at all. And next up, of course, First we have the stumpy little legs here, which are not going to be doing anything. This guy can't run very fast, if at all. And then moving toward the back here, you can see the back legs are even worse. We have click hinges, so they can move up and down very unnaturally. And we have little feet here, which are at such an awkward angle that they really can't do anything either. And another problem that this poor guy runs into is the fact that he is modular, which means you can pull the back apart here and shrink him down even further, which no, it still doesn't work. He just looks like a massive oversized toad. And I have to admit, on the box art, he did look kind of adorable, but in person here, this is just sad. I appreciate what the designers were going with, with a sort of modular design that you, that kids can upgrade as they go, but I have to say, in practice, it actually doesn't work out very well. Alright, so in upgrading this guy, I did try to use as many parts from the original set as possible. Unfortunately, that was not possible, so I did have to add in these extra parts here, which is uh, just a for your information type thing. I'll actually put a part list in the description with the pieces that you do need for this build. But in the meantime, let's go ahead and take a look at the actual build that I came up with. And here we have our upgraded Rocky, who turned out even better than I expected, much to my surprise. So first up, and most importantly, I gave his head some articulation. I used a ball and socket piece here, and that way he can move his head from side to side. And one thing that really helps with that is the fact that I switched the uh, hinge piece for his jaw to these droid arm pieces now. Um, and basically that allows him to turn and move his head just a little farther than he normally would have been able to. And, if, and another big change that I made was uh, improving the legs here. I have replaced the uh, ball and socket pieces with some click hinges so you can get a lot more posability out of him. Of course, I also left the ball and socket pieces attached to the feet here. That way, uh, you know, he can spread out and become even more menacing. And then moving to the back here, you can see that we also bulked up his body and then it gradually tapers toward the legs where again, I added in some click hinges here and then, you know, just the standard feet that he has. So that's it for the changes that I made to this dragon. I'll put a part list in the description with all the parts that you'll need to build him, but don't worry, most of them are actually found in the set. So uh, feel free to download that, gather whatever parts that you don't have, and we'll go ahead and get started building.
Alright, that is it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you made it this far, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and do all that other good stuff. And if you want to see more of my content, please feel free to check out the other videos on my channel. And if there's something you want to see me build, feel free to leave a comment in the comment section below, and I will see what I can do. Again, that's all I have for you guys today, so I will see you next time.